Here we have Ava Unit 01 from the rebuild of Evangelion, the four part movie series based off the anime Neo Genesis Evangelion, which is actually a really good TV anime show and well worth watching if you haven't caught it. It's got a bit of a reputation as being one of the best, well, I think so anyway. It's well worth checking out. So, here we have the figure and his attachments. Comes with the Revoltech booklet as normal, same booklet as was contained in the package with. Ava the unit zero. So nothing strange there. So here we have the additional parts with Ava. It comes with one complete replacement shoulder, which is the left shoulder. No wait. It's the right shoulder left as you're looking. This one here. A gun sight that is mounted into this, which I'll show you in a second. It comes with an ice cream cone. It comes with a knife. It comes with the knife coming out of his um, shoulder pad, that guy there, this pops on, and then the actual shoulder pad when the knife is closed. It comes with a replacement head, it comes with the powered cable to give Ava her juice. So Ava comes with five handsets, um, the usual knife hand, as you can see, well it's a gun hand, knife hand, whichever, no guns with this Ava, a surprise hand, or jumping hand or get away from me stop clobber on time with a bit of bling nice bit of bling going on there yeah thingy hand claw the air so great and finally a bit of just relaxing hand not quite open yeah it might be pointing over there you might not be he you don't know. You don't know what his hand's doing. The first thing I'll show you is the knife. It's very nice. It's a bit of detail. It's small. Nowhere near as nice as Unit Zero's samurai swords, or whatever type of swords you want to call them. I'm calling them samurai swords. So he's got his wee knife here, which he uses for destroying the AT field. So what you have here is you put that on the top, and it looks like he's bashing into the AT field. <laughs> Yep, or you can use it as a lollipop or an ice cream bone or something. Yeah, it's, it's very imaginative. So, what happens is the knife comes out of his shoulder pad. So what you do is you basically put this shoulder pad on, as you can see, which then opens up into this shoulder pad, which then comes a knife, which is great. So. Borrow Ava's shoulder pad, these things just come off. You can just replace them, whichever one you want, but you put on the right way around. There we go. So that would pop off. Then the option to put the other one on. So we bit loose in the shoulder. So you can then get him set up to do the old pull it out of pull it out trick. Of course it's been a bit more time, there you go. You can kind of pull that out. And then finally, you stick it in his hand. It does go in. There we go. And then Ava's going to cut you. He's going to cut you good. So the replacement head is for when he goes into berserker mode which happens once or twice through the anime. Just a nice little head. Not, it's just pretty much a straightforward head. Not a great amount of detail, but it's not, it's just enough, just enough detail. Rightio. So the other shoulder attachment basically is, that's a namer, which turns into this guy here, so it falls out. The little satellite dish pops off. You then give this guy a pull and it pops off as well. So you can then put in his eye attachment. Which basically sits on his shoulder to allow him to aim.
nothing really special about that. Then of course it all pops back together. You put it in the right way up. So it's nicely detailed but again not too much detail. It's not really a big figure is it? Um, the power cord is the exact same as the one with AVA unit 0. Right here the figure itself. So starting at his leg, Revoltech joint 360. Legs doubly jointed. So we can do a 360 at either, either joint. So there we go. His legs twist around. So a bit of kicking. And the other kicking. So about 90 degrees. The hips don't really turn as much as more at the chest. And obviously he's got a bit of poppy action. And he's got a bit of chest movement. Not a great deal. But um, that's great. Now the hands are revolted joints. So 360 and left and right. 360, left and right, or up and down. These guys are a wee bit loose, but again, Revoltec joints, so you can do a 360. If you just be careful that you don't hit it off anything. And that's pretty much it. The head, usual bit of chicken head going on. Uh, he's not as good at this figure. I haven't put the thing back in properly. There we go. Because the head, obviously, has to come off to allow for the changing of the head. So you yeah, crazy looking Ava. It'll definitely cut you. In my review of Ava Unit Zero, I didn't say much about the actual Ava show. Ava begins with Sinji being summoned to Tokyo 3, Nerve Headquarters, by his father Gendo. Sinji is in the dark over why he has been summoned, as his father hasn't been very present in his life up to now. Now, Sinji's psychological profile includes such wonders as anxiety, depression, lack of self-confidence and loneliness, a basket case in the making. All the main characters in the show have some serious psychological flaw. If Freud watched anime, he'd love it. It won't take you long before you think Sinji's a complete loser, but don't let that put you off. As there's lots of cool robots doing what robots know best fighting, and it's got an absolutely kick-ass team tune. The two of the main pilots are Rei of Unit Zero and Asuka of Unit Two. The characters of Evangelion are continuously struggling with interpersonal relationships, their inner demons and traumatic events in their past, creating a complex pattern of relationships. It's all just one big bag of crazy. I won't say much about the infamous ending except that I like the original best. And so it is written in the great book of Wikipedia. The ambiguous and unclear meaning of the ending left many fans confused and unsatisfied. The final two episodes were probably the most controversial segment of a controversial series and were received as flawed and incomplete by many. However, Anno and Deputy Director Kazuya defended the artistic integrity of the finale. May the cursor that seeks the hyperlink of truth always find their way and never be rickrolled by the false linkers. So, the shoulders. You can basically pop off the shoulder pads I find it's easier just to take the arm off. Put Ava down for a second. Or be a good Ava, yeah. So basically you take the arm off, it just pops out. Push it towards the ball. Comes off, you see the little nubs, or little holes for the nubs. There we go. This guy here. And you can see Yeah, there it is. It pops in. So line them up. And just give it a little push. Actually requires a fair bit of pressure. And as you can see, the plastic is starting to score, or this colour anyway, from changing these, which is a little disappointing. So I might actually have to file them down slightly. So I can change it a little more readily without destroying my figure. So there it is snapped in. So as you can see, whoops, it sticks on his shoulder. 
course you can swap it out. Where'd I put you? There you are. So, get a bit of aiming action going on. So this was me with another review saying, Slaunch it.